Hi guys, I am here to do the new release video for January 5th and I'm also going to include the new releases from our reopening on the 1st just because I didn't get a video up that day so then you'll see everything that's available in the shop at the moment. The only thing I'm not going to show you guys in this video that is in the shop is our leftover mystery mailers. Um, oops bags and perfect cut grab bags left over from our old paper so if you're interested in those things you can go find the details in our shop but I'm going to show you all of our regular releases which are all on our premium matte paper and are ready to ship if you see something you like and it sells out it will be restocked um, I'm just still trying to find out how much we need of stock of each item okay so I'm going to start with our kits and I have some monthly kits and notes kits which I thought I would do first since there's less of those. So on the first I reopened and I released all of our January stuff and I immediately started getting a lot of questions about February which I understand a lot of people already had January but I wanted to list it a, I designed it for myself too, I need a January kit so um, my deal with my January um, sorry, not January, my monthly kits in general and my notes kits is I'm doing two different designs per month. So for January, I had, um, a monthly and notes kit based on Stay Cozy, which was a kit I released prior to opening, and it's kind of a winter theme, and it ties in really nicely with the blues of January, and then I did a New Year's theme, um, obviously to start 2018, and that would look really nice in the neutral. So I'm doing two themes per month. Um, that way you guys have some variety, and if you're like me and have several planners, you will have a kit, different kit for every planner if you would like one. So I guess I will start with the Stay Cozy stuff. I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit here. There we go. Okay, so the first thing I will do is the notes kit. And these are two pages and are $7. So the first sheet, it has, um, I want to say this, the month is actually cut out. It's not a strip. It's not a square strip. Um, it actually looks like this. So it's cut out like that and it can just lay across the top. I'm going to do a video with my note spreads so you will be able to see how I use these. But you have your month, you have a large flag that you can put right up next to the month. You have your currently this month and a bunch of different activities you're doing. Your four circles, three smaller flags, and these are actually four different checklists but they are only two different stickers um, to go down the two different um, sections. And then on the top here, we have one, two, three, four different headers that you can put in these four. And there are four smaller words that you can put in the circles. If you don't want to use those words, you can always write them in, but I thought I would give you guys a few, that way you had them. So the ones that I have included is monthly to-do list, reasons to celebrate, planning schedule, and monthly to clean list, that's for the checklist. And for the circles, I have included verse, focus, goal, and thankful. So that is the January, and the format is the same for every month. I'm planning on keeping our format very similar. That way I can um, I can design things way in advance. I also wanted to um, preference that, uh, reference that um, some of these sheets are square edge and round edge. They are the same sheets. Um, I switched to square edge, um, cutting the sheets out myself after I'd done a few things. So um, if you get a few rounded edge, don't be alarmed. It's okay. Um, and then this is the matching Stay Cozy January kit for the monthly view. So you have four flags. You have your date dots. Um, they're actually date numbers that cut around around the number. A movie marquee, three planners, and then your big um, strip. So this ends right here and that one goes on the left and then this one will go on the right. That's page one. These kits are four pages and are $13. Page two um, for January has one box right here and then a big thing with three, three boxes long, um, three boxes, four checklists, and then several strips to mark out like traveling or other things that could be several days. Um, the third page has three movie marquees, three more boxes, so many icons, like you should have enough for everything. I tried to think of things like um, having enough... Um, like trash icons for every day of, um, or sorry, once a week for the whole month and those type of things. So hopefully you have enough icons. And then some um, 
marquee squares up here, and these ones are the holidays for the month. And I'm just doing the holidays that are in the Erin Condren. So there's New Year's Day, Kwanzaa Ends, and Martin Luther King Jr. Day. And then page four has your bill dues and paydays, and then your appointment labels. And I tried to include a ton of these because that's one of the things that I've noticed um, with other monthly kits is that I never feel like I have enough bill dues and uh, paydays. So I included a ton. So that is our monthly kit format. I'm going to put those back in the baggie. And then this is our New Year's notes kit. Um, again, I'm not going to go too in depth now that you guys have seen this, but it's the same exact words, three flags, these two stickers, the currently this month, and that's the New Year's theme for January. And then the monthly for New Year's January. It's really cute. I love this floral pattern right here and the colors of this are super cute. And then the last sheet. So that's the two options for January. And we're always gonna do two different themes um, with a matching notes kit. So those are purchased separately, um, $7 and $13. And then for February, I had two different options. I did a Valentine's Day one, which I'm calling mine, and that would be this one and that one. And then um, I did a non-Valentine's Day, but kind of girly still, just so that um, it still fits in with those pinks, but it's not Valentine's-y if you're not a lovebird. So I'll do the Valentine's Day one first. This is mine. Um, and... Again, same format. I love these patterns. This was a clip art that came out last year, and I've already had requests to make it into a weekly kit. So if that's something you'd like to see, please comment down below and let me know. Um, I have already gotten requests about the beauty one too, which I'll show you next. So I think both of these could come to the shop if enough people are interested in them. So that's the My Notes page kit, and then this is the monthly. I love the candy hearts and just how bold that is. Again, this is our premium mat, so the printing is amazing and it's super soft and smooth to the touch. Um, the stickers cut and peel so nicely and all around I just love it. Um, it's a waterproof paper. It's not com it's not removable, but they are pretty easy to pull up. Um, Except for with the foiled stickers, I recommend not pulling those up just because you can crack the foil. But with regular other stickers, it's really quite easy. So this is um, Beauty Babe February Notes Kit. You can see that girl. So, so cute. And I love the color scheme of this one too. So that's the Beauty Babe February Notes and then we have the matching February monthly. And th this pattern is obviously my favorite. A lot of the time my favorite pattern goes into like the bottom washi or in the monthly kits is this. I love the floral in this. And this too is one of my favorites. Um, for February, there is a big section of four and a big section of three. So I did those the same pattern. So on the top and the bottom of the month, it would kind of pull it together and coordinate. So I hope you guys like that. And there was more holidays, so you only get one blank um, marquee box, but um, I did all the other holidays that were in the Erin Condren. So that's the Beauty Babe February monthly kit. Okay, so those are the monthly kits that are available. I have had a request already about the March, so I will try to get that out maybe next week or the week after, um, and then we will release more in the future. So those are the monthly kits, and then next we can get to the weekly kits. So first I'll show you the kit and then I'll show you the coordinating glitter. Um, I'm going to show you the full kits. Um, I pulled all the full kits, but the mini kit is just the first four pages. So I will show you guys that. First kit I'm going to show you guys is called Roses and I love this kit. Um, I think it reminds me specifically of The Bachelor, but that's just because I'm a Bachelor fan. Um, <laughs> uh, the reds in this kit are amazing and we have this Fashion girl sitting like right up by the water, um, a dinner, 
a dinner uh, table, I can't think of what that was called, a dinner table with two chairs, and then this like really pretty scene over here, and then these abstract patterns, um, this rose pattern is my favorite, you will see it again, but with this kit I thought it would be perfect for Valentine's Day week, especially this dinner box, I could envision for myself, my husband and I always go out to dinner. Uh, Valentine's Day and so you could write where you're going to dinner on this box. I left some room at the top just for that reason so yeah I, I'm in love with this kit. It's pretty simple but it is elegant and I like it a lot. So here's a good look at the color scheme. I, I should go over this just so you guys know I'm sorry. There are eight full boxes, sorry, eight full boxes, one weekly habit tracker and then three appointment labels at the bottom. The next page is our page two, which has our headers and our littles, our weekend manner, and four daily habit trackers. Um, these, this is kind of how I envision kits is I will go, like if I was placing the stickers down, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is like the accent color, and then you go back Friday, Saturday, Sunday. That's how I design kits, so that's why you don't get enough, like you don't get two sets of the black, you get less of the black because that's like your accent day, if that makes sense. Um, and then page three, you have your date covers, another weekly habit tracker, your two Erin Condren flags, your bottom washi, and then you have some um, washi strips right here. And then your checklist and two planners. On the planners, I love for marking uh, midweek spread and um, plan with me's or um, you know posting on Instagram. And then page four has your 10 half boxes, your nine quarter boxes, and a bunch of icons. So this would be the mini kit. And this is the same for every single collection. So that's our mini kit. And then our full kit comes with these pages, but they also come with these two additional pages. Um, so you have a ton of washi up here. You have your pattern washi, your solid color washi, you have your deco, your time dots, and then you have four movie marquees, four small bubble boxes. You have the fourth color of the appointment label so that you have one of each color. And then um, over here you have these three and you get that fourth color there. And then on the last sheet you get your, my camera is focusing, okay. Um, you get your ombre heart checklist, your last weekly habit tracker, and then like I said, those three medium bubble boxes. So that is our kit format. We have six page full kits or four page mini kits and I found that people are really loving that. Our mini kits are $13 and our ultimate kits are $18. Some of you are like, where's the glitter, Chelsea? Because I've always done glitter in my kits. But I decided to do it separately so that people could get it if they wanted it with their mini kit, or maybe you're just a glitter fanatic and you just wanna get glitter sheets and pair it from another shop or build your glitter collection, whatever you want. So I will show you um, the two options that can pair with um, roses. It does, I did create this um, marble sheet. This is actually under the um, 50 shades listing if you're looking for it, but this does match the same glitter, or, um, sorry, marble that's featured right here in this box and in the date covers. So this is our, um, it's usually our glitter sampler. This is a sparkle marble sampler, but what it has is it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, headers in each little square right here. So you get 8, 16, 24, 32 headers. You get your marquee squares, four appointment labels, four medium boxes, and eight flags. So that is our sampler format. This is again the sparkle marble and this will stay in our shop because I really love the marble as you can tell. So this will be um, something that will stay in our shop as a single sheet. This is the glitter that is specifically for roses as you can tell pulling in the red and the gray and the pink. So those match for roses. Okay, so let's move on to the next kit. The next kit, I'm gonna go a little faster because we already have gone through the format now. So the next one is called Mean Girls. It's obviously a Mean Girls kit. I'm super excited about this one because I love designing it. So this top box up here says haters gonna hate and then it has Regina George, has a Diet Coke can, um, she has a jacket that says MG, Mean Girls, the plastics with the Kate Spade bag, she's reading the burn book and it says on Wednesdays we wear pink, a little frappuccino, and then it's a Kate Spade watch and it says when pigs, and then it looks like, like flying pigs, when pigs fly, and then the phone that says I'm not a regular mom, I'm a cool mom, that's probably my favorite box because 
I seriously love Amy Poehler and I love that she was the mom in that because I love her from Parks and Rec. So side note, but it's hilarious to me. So this is the first page. Here's the color scheme. You can see it a little better on this sheet. This is a faux gold foil. It is not real gold foil, but um, it's just supposed to look fancy. And then the boxes and icons. You have your burn book um, box, and then you have like a planner box. And then the last sheet with your um, checklist. So that is the Mean Girls kit. Sorry, I'm trying to put these away as we go. That way I don't have a huge cleanup at the end. And I think this video is going to be pretty long since I'm showing all the new releases, so I apologize for that. And then here is the glitter sampler for Mean Girls. And then the next kit is Adventure Awaits, and this has been really, really popular on my Instagram. People were really loving this, and they're sending me messages about it, so that's super exciting. Um, this one is definitely a travel-inspired kit, um, but it's not so specific, so it can go for any trip you're going on, which I really love. And the colors of this kit are what really got me. I don't do navy very often, but I'm going to try to work it in more in 2018, because this kit is killing me. Like, this navy is the whole reason I love this kit, so... These are the full boxes. We have like a planner, your traveling accessories, passport, and then like the window. Um, you have a girl over here taking a picture out of, of a window and you'll see, um, taking a picture out of a window, I think I said that twice. Um, you'll see how we're gonna be doing our girls in this kit. So this is page one. Here's the color scheme. Again, loving the navy, so, so pretty. Page three, page four. And then page five. So this is how we're gonna be doing our girls. The first page will be a brunette, almost always. And the reason for this is two things. A, yes, I am a brunette and I am drawn to that box um, because that's what I look like. But secondly, in the past I did do, I'm gonna zoom out just a tad. Um, oh, other way. I did do the option of choosing your own girl, like I had a drop down menu and brunette was chose 85% of the time. So I've decided to choose that as the usual automatic choice and that will be the option in the mini kit. But if you get the full kit, you will have the blonde and the African American girl if those are offered. Those will be the next two. If there isn't one of those, then it will be different. But if I do get a brunette, a blonde, and an African American, it will always be um, Burnett in the main full boxes and then you will have them the other options here So that's how the kits are gonna be just letting you guys know in advance. So this is page five and Then page six so if you're looking for a blonde or an african-american and you're really wanting that then I would get the full kit Because that's how you're gonna get those So that is adventure awaits again uh, dying over this kit and then let me grab the glitter header sampler here is the glitter header sampler so so stinking pretty so there's that the next kit is get fit and i've been sitting on this clip art for a long long time some of you might remember it came out last year of this clip art and a couple of shops did it and i just held off but i thought it's a perfect kit to release around new year's everybody's trying to get back into fitness and get healthy so um i know it's one of my 2018 goals so if you're into that and you're trying to get healthy this kit is pretty cute and motivating so the little bottle here says gym now wine later and then you have your girl here this girl is brunette but her hair is barely showing so um you know, if that bothers you, I did include the other options, but her hair is barely showing. And then there's some cute Adidas shoes. Those are probably my favorite box. Color scheme, super bright. This Premier Matte does these colors really well. I don't think I could have done a color scheme like this on my other paper. It just would not have printed well, um, but it really does do these colors well. It's impressive. And then here's the next sheet. Um, these lotus flowers are definitely my favorites of these like of the patterns that were offered in this um clip art set and then we have our boxes and then here's the page with the other girls so she does have blonde hair again it just didn't show very much and then your african-american girl 
super super cute and a detail that i really love is that i added her little fitbit on or her apple watch whatever you want to what do you want to call it and i think that's so cute oh my gosh and then your checklist so that is get fit and then i have the matching glitter as always again the mini kit is just the first four pages Glitter is always a la carte, and it is this sheet for $3.75. The next kit is Wild and Free, and the colors on this kit printed amazing. Probably my favorite kit just color-wise um, because they just look so stinking vibrant. I thought this kit would be a perfect transition from winter to spring. Um, the colors are deep, but there's all these florals, and this girl is such... A rock star like her hair oh gosh it is so pretty so this is the first box um first sheet of wild and free here are the colors i mean look at how vibrant they are so pretty probably gonna hear me say that like a million times but seriously and then this blue whew, boxes i did include this girl and then this kind of wintry scene and then the checklist Okay, so that is wild and free. Sorry if I'm going a little fast, but I don't want to like have this video be like too, too long. It's already probably going to be like an hour or so. Um, and then here are the glitter headers. And those are a la carte. So if you already have that kit or you don't want the kit, but maybe you're into the color scheme, you can totally just pick up the glitter. The next one is called Victoria's Secret, and it's obviously inspired by one of my favorite stores. Um, they did have the fashion show, and so that's kind of where the inspiration for that girl is pulled in, but I just think it would be super cute for Valentine's Day week um, with the pinks and the lingerie. I think it's super, super cute, and I'm into the lacy boxes. Those are probably my favorite ones. So yeah, these are the full boxes in Victoria's Secret. These are definitely lighter pinks, um, camera is picking up this a little harder to see. I think it's just my lights, but you can obviously still see the white. Um, it's just my lights are kind of uh, washing it out. That lace though is so pretty. And then you do have your blonde and your African American, and then your check boxes. Gorgeous kit. And the glitter headers for this one are a little bit different. It's not my usual glitter um, because I used a different pattern glitter in this full box. And for that, I did matching of that glitter instead of our normal. As you can tell, this is our normal glitter and then this is this kit's glitter. So it is a slightly different glitter texture and I did all gold because I think with these colors, I think this will just look so good. So gold glitter is always a good one to pick up. And then the last kit available right now is our 50 Shades kit. This is something that I was super excited about. I finished designing this yesterday and, oh gosh, I just, oh, I love this kit. So these are the full boxes and just take a minute. But I will say this is pretty risque. So if you are not of age of seeing this movie and, um, then you should just look away. But this is such a good, I, I'm like... This is one of those kits where I was like, babe, look at this. When I was designing it, I had to show my husband because I did a monochrome scheme, which I usually don't do, and I am obsessed. So, okay, full boxes. And then here's the color scheme. Obviously, different shades of gray. This is a gray. It's picking up a little black, but it's like a deep, deep, deep charcoal. And, oh, heavens. And then I went with our all marble for the patterns, um, gray, obviously, so, and she is so gorgeous, oh my god, and then the deco, and then the checklist, so that is 50 shades, and I'm super excited to use this on Valentine's Day week, because I'm definitely going to go see the movie that week, and I'm super excited, so that's that, and then for this, again, you can pick up the Sparkle Marble, which matches this kit. This is in the 50 Shades listing, or you can get the actual glitter sampler. I do have both, just in case you would like those. I personally think I'm gonna buy, um, will pull some of my silver 
foil and use that because let me just we can do that next how about that that's a good transition um like our foil sampler with this um I don't know how this is going to be hard to film foil guys but silver foil with this kit would look so so good so moving on to our foil I created a sampler that is the same thing as the glitter sampler except for I whited out the spaces to write on the appointment labels, the marquee boxes, and the medium boxes just so you can write on it. If you are wanting to write on the actual foil like say on the flags or on the appointment label just use a permanent ultra fine sharpie. Those are what I found to be the best thing to write on actual foil. Um, my other thing is that Try to place the sticker the best you can the first time. I do have it in my listing that, you know, when you pull up foil, there is a chance of cracking, so it's best to just leave it the first time. Um, but yeah, so I do have this in rose gold. Again, filming this and taking pictures of foil is so difficult, but this is the rose gold. These big sheets are $5 for foil. Gold and silver. And then the only other foil, these are just the two items I have, are the sampler sheet, which is this, or I just have the headers. So you just get a full thing of silver headers, a full thing of gold, or a full thing of rose gold. And these are $3.75, and then the samplers are $5. Why as well just mention it now, our current freebies are foiled headers. So you will get either a rose gold, a gold, or a silver in your order. It's kind of just random, whatever I just grab and throw in there, but you will get one of these. I'm really trying to, um, you know, just show that I'm doing foil, get that out there, and give you guys kind of like a special freebie because these do take extra time and um, do cost me a little bit more money, but I want to say thank you to you guys for ordering. So these are our current freebies. Okay, the last thing we have to go over are all of these single sheets. So I'm going to go kind of fast, but I will say um, that there are some real good ones in here. So I'll start with kind of the single sheets first. Um, the first thing that is on here is for our kits, actually. If you open one of our kits, let me grab one for you guys and you go to page three where our date covers are, you'll notice that we don't have date dots. And that's because I was so tired of after every single kit, wasting all of those other date dots that don't and can't fit on a week. So I decided to just make it a single sheet. So if you're wanting um, to use date dots on your kit instead of write the numbers, then just grab this extra sheet. This is 275 in our shop. And it has three months worth. So if you picked up four of these, you'll be set for the entire year. And it also has an asterisk and, and two money signs for each month as well. So super good deal. Um, but I just decided to make these separate so that you're not paying for me to use space up for these stickers when you're not going to use half of them. I mean, a three fourths of them for your week, if that makes sense. I hope you guys understand that change, but in my mind, it just makes sense um, to give you guys more more functional stickers and less stickers like this that you wouldn't even be able to use. So this sheet is our date number sheet and this is in our kit section in our shop and this is 275. All of our small sheets like this are 275 and our foiled sheets that are this size are 375. So these are all 275. This sheet I kind of made for myself and I decided to list anyways. This is the Bikini Body Guide. If you guys know what that is, this is kind of some stickers to mark what week you are on. I was going to put these in the sidebar. So I just have 1 through 12 and I have that four times. That way you can get almost a year of it. Um, and that was kind of my plan. She has 1.0 and 2.0 and um, each of those are 12 weeks. So you could do each guide twice in a year basically. So... Hopefully you guys like these. Um, I don't know if anybody else will really pick them up, but I think they're cute. So, you know, just a little reminder, it just says BBG week one, and then it just says what week you're on. And then related in that same kind of category um, are these weight loss goals stickers. So they start just with one pound, two pound. So then you can mark, um, you know, maybe every week, like where, you know, once you've lost that weight, you can put, okay, I've lost one pound by this day, two pounds, and then all the way all the way up to 50 pounds and then there are four non-scale victory um, scales on there and then the next sheet is the saving goals sheet 
excuse me, um, this sheet has little piggy banks and this might be a little bit confusing but it goes by 20s from $20 all the way up to $1,000 and basically you save $20 a week and set that aside and then you will save up $1,000 in 50 weeks. So almost a year and you could just set aside $20 a week and have $1,000 at the end of the year if you're trying to save up for something. So I thought that was kind of a smart thing to do um, if maybe around Christmas time you needed that extra money to save up every year or maybe for a vacation or to buy something special. So that's the saving guide. And you can always do, you know, double. You could do like 40 every week or, you know, you could make it your own, but it just goes by $20 increments. And then the next sheets kind of go together. Um, I had a bigger sheet of this when I had my old paper and my old sheet size, and this is our bachelor stickers. I did make the gray a little darker so it was easier to see, but besides that, they are basically the same thing. Um, the first one is Bachelor in Paradise, so it has Season Premiere, The Final Rose, and then two After Paradise stickers, and then a bunch of Bachelor in Paradise. There are enough for the season. I checked on like all the previous seasons, and there is enough, so um, that's The Bachelor in Paradise. The next one is The Bachelor, which would be great to grab right now um, with Ari season, and again, Season Premiere, premiere The Woman Tell All, The Final Rose, and The Next Bachelorette. And then the next one is The Bachelorette, and it has season premiere, The Men Tell All, The Final Rose, and The Next Bachelor. Again, love these. I love designing them, and I didn't want to change them because I love them so much. So those are in the shop. Um, the next little section, we are going to be adding a lot more of these in the future, but I just released six for right now, and these are our Bellas. So I have a shop character who I doodled, and then I add in multicolor clip art with her. And so um, this is her. Let me give you a better shot of her. And this looks just like my English Bulldog. If you haven't seen her, you can go over to my Instagram. And I'm pretty sure I have a picture of her on my Instagram. And I kind of Insta story her like every day. So she's on there a lot. Um, and this is Happy Mail Bella. Open Planner Bella. Spiral Planner ring planner and in one hand she's hand holding the planner and in the other hand she's holding stickers and then tn planner and then just all stickers so those are those sheets again these are 275 and i adore her she's just neutral um i have been wanting to do a character but i can't be ready to ship with all the skin tones and hair options so little bb is my little shop character and she has a lot more coming, but I was focused on getting all these icons done first. <laughs> so for years, I have been asked to take my icons from my kits and my monthly kits and all of that and put them into single rainbow sheets. And I have not done it. And finally, I sat down one day and I did all these in one day, but it literally took so many, so many hours, but it is done. They are here. So I have 45 sheets. 45 icons. They're the ones that are in the kits plus a few more. So I'm going to go ahead and flip through these. I'm going to show you. Here's the kind of rainbow scheme. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. And I'm going in order um, by their SKU number. So the first one is the cakes, the airplanes, Target, the book, the barbell, the pencils, the phones, the wrenches, the houses, the gas pumps, the grocery carts, the fork and knives, the paw prints, the lawn mowers, the thumbs up, the cooking pot, the video clapper, the TV, the kettle ball, envelopes, hearts, heartbeat, tooth, dollar sign, gift, spray bottle, wine, delivery truck, computer, file, clipboard, clock, shopping bag, bible, wedding rings, scale, watering can, gaming, to go coffee, stethoscope, dainty bows, hair dryer, washing machine, recycling, 
and trash. Those are our 45 icons that are available. Those are all the icons that you see in our kit. So if you have, for instance, um, I don't know, maybe you want two grocery stickers in one week and my kids only have one, or maybe you go to church twice a week and you need a church sticker, or maybe you water your plants three times a week and you need three icons, but my kids only come with one. These are just ways that I thought of that um, I've had so many people say, can you put two of these or two of these, and I can't do things like that that are kind of custom, but this is a way of being able to add in more icons and you can get exactly what's useful for you. And our color scheme, palette is huge so you should find a color that matches every single week and if you want several of the same color per week then just grab a couple of the same sheet so i hope you guys love those because those i'm, I'm really happy with the color scheme i'm really happy with the icons and i'm pretty proud of those because they took me a while so so yeah we had our icons our bellas our bachelor stickers our goals our date covers and I went over the foiled items and all of our kits. So if the only only things I didn't go over again were the um, clearance items, basically you can check our, our clearance section. Those things are in our old paper, um, but they are beautiful. And there are some um, sheets of our new paper um, samplers and all of those things, just so that you guys can try those. And I hope you guys have liked this video. Um, this is my first kind of new releases video and I'm planning to do these every Friday. This one went up a little late because I had a long day at work on Friday and between getting up new releases, I just didn't get to the video that day. But I did get it up on Saturday so that you guys can enjoy it and then look forward to a play of me coming on Monday. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you haven't and comment down be below what your favorite new release was. Bye, guys.